In this video, we're going to explain how to properly set up the 7 inch 0700L display from ELO. First, you'll want to make the connections, the USB connections. You need to connect both these cables to available USB ports on your computer. Here we've made the connections on the bottom side of one of ELO's all-in-one touch computers and the USB ports. If you're connected to the internet with your computer, most likely after you connect the USB cables, uh, it will automatically go out and search for drivers on Windows 7 and Windows 8. Uh, that's what this did. This is Windows 7. It went out and automatically found the drivers and it's wanting me to install them. Now you can you can do it this way, uh, accept it and just go through the setup, or you can go to the displaylink.com website and download the driver. Uh, if you're using Windows XP, that's what you would have to do. Uh, XP for some reason does not go out and automatically find the driver for you. So we're going to go ahead and do the driver setup. This is Windows 7, and once the display is connected there's still no video on the screen there will not be any video on the screen until after the drivers are installed just keep that in mind okay so we're going to go through the setup of the driver software for the display link 0700L and is it, it is an AccuTouch touchscreen on it and we'll set the driver for the touchscreen up uh, a little later in this procedure right now we're displaying the display driver We'll go ahead and accept the agreement. It starts installing and it's very normal for the screen to flash several times and it tells you in your dialog box that it will flash during this process, normal. Okay, so the driver's installed and you can now see that we have display on the 0700L as well as our, our main video screen. Now the 0700L and the display link drivers automatically set it up to extended desktops. If that's the way you want to have your desktop configure, configured, then that's perfectly fine. You can go ahead and make any adjustments you want here. Uh, it automatically brought up the Windows display properties for you. However, there, for the touchscreen driver for the 0700L, it is an AccuTouch monitor, USB. So you go to the elotouch.com website, hover over support, choose downloads, current drivers. And since this is a Windows 7 machine, we're going to click here. If you're using XP or Vista or right now Windows 8, there's not a Windows 8 driver available on the website yet, but the Windows 7 driver works with Windows 8. So simply click on the header for that, click on the driver link, read the license agreement, accept it, and then to download the driver you click here. Okay, once the driver has downloaded to the downloads folder or whatever location you've selected, then you go out and we find it in our downloads folder. Simply double click, choose run, OK, and just leave this location where it will unzip the files to. It's temp on your C drive. Click unzip. Successful, click OK. And this is the uh, Windows 7 security wants you to verify the, the driver is okay to install, say yes. Default language is English, you can leave it at default or select English or whatever your language may be. Choose next. Now I'm installing USB touch monitors, the all-in-one touch computer is USB and so is the 0700L display link and it's USB as well, the touchscreen. So we're going to install only USB touchscreen drivers. Do not select serial or APR if you do not have those connected. Choose next. Read the license agreement. 
Say yes. And it will start installing the drivers. This doesn't take very long. All right, now you can choose to read the view me if you'd like or just leave it unselected. But make sure you do the calibration. Here it's going to calibrate all touchscreen ELO touchscreen monitors. We keep that selected, choose finish. Now we're going to calibrate the monitors, align. Click check the target. That target, that one. Cursor is following our finger. We choose okay. Next, it's went to the 0700L display, so we'll want to touch the target, target, target. The cursor is following my finger. OK. Choose the green check mark. Now, both of these products are aligned, and we have it on both screens. As you can see, touch is perfect on this screen, right under my finger and touch is perfect on this screen right on my finger. Once the display link drivers are installed, if you go down in your lower right taskbar near your clock, choose the arrow up button and there you'll find the display link icon. It's called USB display. You click on it once and it gives you a menu of options. Here's where you can change your extended mode, extended to, your rotation, your resolution, you can also have it mirror your main display. You may also use the 0700L as a primary display or a single display only, but you will have to do the setup uh, to get the video working before that's possible. Now we've moved the 0700L display to the top of this primary display. And if you do that, you'll want to go in and do the calibration again in the ELO touchscreen properties because it will no longer be calibrated correctly. Once you calibrate it, then you can do whatever you want in the, in the 0700. For instance, I could take this internet browser, uh, just grab it with the mouse, and pull it up into the display. And now you have your internet browser running only on the 0700. And it has touch. You can touch it and, and navigate through websites, uh, whatever you'd like. You could have your POS application in the 0700 or a customer readout, whatever it is you would like to do, but you can just drag uh, any program into it and it should work. 